So we're going to show you this um, integration of how you can use Hugging Face to build a model. You can then um, generate the um, inference from the model, and then you can feed that into your agent on Agentverse. And to do that, what you need to do is build a model, uh, put it on Hugging Face, get the inference API, and give it to the agent. So, so we've done that. Now let's have a look at uh, how you can actually test it. So the way you're going to test it is on Delta V. So let's say, um, yeah, let's 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 look at this. So let's say this is, yeah, th th there's a company called Go EV, um, and it has it's low on cash reserves. How do we know? Kamal, it's low on cash reserve. We did some research. On yeah, yeah, I mean, the, the stock has not been doing too well. Stock and, is not uh, doing well. and they had the recent financial statement coming out, which showed that they were low okay. on cash reserve. So we, we want Finbird, which is the model we're hosting on Hugging Face. So you can just see that on Hugging Face. Uh, here's the Finbird model. That's the model which is feeding into our agent verse. So we go back into uh, the agent verse. So we, we create on Agentverse, we created this agent, and this is the code for the agent. Uh, it's, it's quite simple, it's nothing that overly complicated. What you're doing is you're putting your, um, your key and API um, yeah. address, um, and, and you're adding that here, you can, sh you can see the model, and you, you run, uh, run this agent. Now we're running the agent, so if you can see the agent uh, before we go to show it. Yeah. So this was the protocol, but if you go back and see the, yeah, so here's the agent, that's running. Active, running, that's yeah. active. So now this agent is available to be discovered. Yep. Right, so we're now going to go to Delta V, which is our prompt engineering interface. So we're going to type something like this in there. Um, I mean, we can, we can try some other prompts as well, but so let's say, okay, so so what you can see here is it's picked up multiple agents which exist on Agentverse. Now, as this is an engineering interface, uh, it's giving you all the options. So let's say we choose option number one and two. Yeah. So to choose option one and two, you just go in, you collect, connect. So what this is doing is it's actually putting those two things together and running it. So it's going to go to one agent for one thing, it's going to go to the other agent for the other thing, and it's going to give you the outcome. Yeah, and the second one here is just going to give the stock price. Yeah, so so this is how you combine the two agents to to do a task. Now this this task could be anything, but let's have a look at let's have a look at what's coming up. Okay, so it's so just confirming. Just confirming again the context. because this is a, a kind of a prompt engineering interface. It's a dev interface, effectively. Uh, the user doesn't have to once you've trained it. Uh, this 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 prompt might not be even needed. And right. here in the in the dev mode, you can see what. Yeah, the so you can see in the dev mode, you can see what what's happening. You mm. can see the chain of thought. You can see what the agents are doing. Right now, so what we have here is so this this task was executed, and you can see the result coming live, which is the overall sentiment for data is negative. Here's the original scores. Now you can see negative score, neutral, positive. So it's actually used the Finbert model to actually provide live update. Right, so And we so can also run that. the same thing in, in uh, Hugging Face to show that it actually pulls up the same. Yeah, so, so Hugging Face. Okay. So now we go and we confirm the, the shares. So th this is a separate agent, and that agent, what it does is takes your symbol it actually just goes and finds you the share price, and that's what it's doing. So there we go. Now we have a share price, which is current share price is, is that. So, so what, what we really have done here is we've taken a machine learning model and joined it with some API for just simple thing like a share price, put them two together, and you can actually run it on Delta V. What, what is quite interesting is, as, as you can see, Delta V is just for prompt engineering. What you can do is you can run the same thing from your WhatsApp or any messaging system. Um, so, so now you have a financial system you can access uh, from wherever you are. There we go. Thank you. Thank you.